we are going to start our group discussion the topic is be a good person but don't try to prove it good evening my respected teacher and my dear friends yes i agree with this topic this quote was told by paul coelho and uh, it's totally right because at, at first i will tell about the definition of a good person a good person is a person who treats everyone with his uh, kindness which is good behavior bad behavior de- depends on the other person like i can give an example that for a uh, for a thief uh, for uh, for a police who is catching a thief the uh, police is being considered uh, as a good person by the normal people of the society but for the thief he is a bad person because he is catching him so the definition of good person is not uh, straight not straight it differ uh, it is different to uh, it, it varies to ma- uh, by man to man so um, we should work on uh, the society we should work to improve the society rather than uh, the recognition of a good person because um, it is uh, quite impossible to be a good person be a proper person that's all yes it is absolutely right Uh, if you uh, want to prove uh, someone uh, you are good or bad that uh, is very bad for us because uh, if you prove it then uh, you always uh, tensed about it and uh, you always think that how can uh, you uh, prove uh, him or uh, her uh, so uh, your work will be hampered so that's why i think uh, it is a very bad thing for us we should always uh, do our work and uh, focus uh, always it uh, time always uh, save uh, at last you are good or not that's all yeah i agree with this topic be a good person first you uh, need to understand that uh, if you are good or not so if you are good so then you can un- uh, then you need to understand that your surrounding people are good or bad if you see that your friends or your surrounding people are doing something bad you obviously uh, go uh, to them uh, close to them and make them understand that uh, they are doing bad so give them some lessons and uh, some teaching so that they can be uh, better in in their life but if they are not listening you so then leave that person or you just keep them away uh, this uh, person or this friends or this toxic people in your life so that you can live your life very peacefully and uh, smoothly if you can understand that your surroundings people are no, uh, not very much uh, supporting uh, for you not are very much good person then you don't need to prove it that you are good or bad uh, always you are doing your uh, your work and your work will say at the ta- end of the day that you are good or bad you just uh, do in your own way and honestly all the work and the time will say that you are good or bad I think that don't waste this time for proving someone that you are good you just do your work and uh, go ahead in your uh, future life and goals that uh, the time will say that you are good that's all so i agree with this topic uh, to become a good person in our life we should the behave in a good manner to the other people of society and the we should help each other in their in our troubles and problems and uh, if we see that uh, other people are not behaving well with uh, another and they are uh, behaving in a bad manner with them we should try to uh, make them understand that they, they are not doing the right thing and they should become good they should behave in a good manner with the other persons we should uh, try again and again to uh, teach them but if they are not understanding it and they are making a joke of you then uh, we should not uh, should not leave it there. Uh, if i am a good person then the time will definitely tell it we should do only our work and uh, if the work is good then there uh, is no need to prove it because after some time the time will definitely prove it so
that yes i uh, i don't also agree with this topic with this topic uh, at first <coughs> we should be a good person because uh, if we have uh, very much honesty uh, in our work or in our life so this is help this helps us to improve our future and to improve achieve our goal we do many great work uh, for our society or great uh, uh, do a great job but if uh, there is no honesty uh, we don't take any help from others and uh, our society also forget me so good person is uh, very much uh, helps us to uh, m- to make a bright society but if that i am good then the par- uh, all person are uh, see me in a suspicious way that if you are, if you good then why you look uh, and uh, why you say uh, that you are good uh, because uh, no good people or good person uh, can say that they are good so good evening sir good evening everyone uh, so today our topic is uh, being a good person doesn't mean that you have to prove it to everybody and uh, i am agree with this topic and uh, if i uh, think a person is an ideal one or is a good one he would never tries to do anything that will consume his time for uh, nothing uh, this world everybody won't be a uh, won't be your friend always or uh, won't give you a nice response whenever you give you uh, uh, done a good job but uh, if you are really nice from your heart you uh, really don't uh, get offended by whatever the others uh, uh, talking about uh, about you. and uh, the main thing is the one who is really a good one uh, or a good person or really did good for others he knows that whatever he did uh, automatically he will be in the limelight uh, uh, once in uh, for his life uh, because doing good will eventually catch others attention at uh, attention at any point of your life and uh, that's the main thing and the one who used to uh, doing good jobs he knows that thing that's why he don't uh, consume his time uh, grabbing others attention that's yes uh, basically i want uh, again uh, about this topic i want to give a example that uh, uh, before of before the vote every politician they are uh, promoting themselves that uh, uh, promoting themselves or big vote uh, so that uh, you please vote me that's uh, if you vote me then i will be do everything for you that's all thing that i am the good person and other party politics person is a very bad they do not give you any uh, kind any successful position in your area or something else but uh, i think if you are good person and uh, that is uh, that is if the already your area area person know that you are a good person then do not uh, waste your time by promo- promoting yourself because they and you know that whatever uh, situation may be i will be win in my area if uh my motive is and my work is seen by themselves or my area people that i will be uh, develop my area or i will be doing such a good work for my area then uh, automatically they will uh, they will give up so be a good person but don't waste your time to prove it it's a very genuine quote always you will find nobody will allow you to stay in good position in honest position if you want to be good and honest there will be so many obstruction in your life but you should ignore it if in your mind you think that you are okay you are not doing any harm to others you are not 
doing any dishonest work, then let them tell whatever they tell. Then you have to think that they are very much jealous of your work. So you should not hear and you should not go to prove that, to argue that you are in good position and you are really want to do good for others that need not, you need not say that. Because if you want to say that, those who are intentionally telling you, they will not, they will never understand and they will never admit, but in their mind they know that very well who are you. But they will not admit that and you will go on proving that you are good, you are good and your time will be wasted automatically and they want that. They want that. Why people are telling abusive word or any unjust word to, uh, towards others? Because they want to irritate you. They want to disturb you. They don't want that you will be a good person, you will be an honest pe person, your fame will be uh, spread, uh, spreading all over the country, all over the state. They don't want that. That means you have to realize you are in good position. That's why they are telling this. But if there is any well wiser, selflessly, those you think that they are your real well wiser, they will never tell you. Criticize. Actually, everybody want to criticize. Criticize, there is a category, two types of criticism. One is for your good, one is for your bad. The well wiser criticizing you, it is for your good. They want your good. Selflessly they will tell that the work you are doing, it is wrong. You should not do that. Then you think they are selflessly telling this. They have no interest in it. So you have to rectify that. And some people are out of jealous. They are, they are telling you very bad work. Then you have to realize that they don't want that you become a good person, you become an honest person. So, according to Bhagavad Gita, you just go on working honestly. Result will automatically come, you need not go to prove that you are doing very hard work, you are doing very honest work and there is no impurity in your work, you need not tell. If you go on like this way, to whom you are trying to making them understand, you will never be able to su get success because they are doing it intentionally to obstruct your work so that people will tell you bad and you are going on arguing, debating and they want this. So, in conclusion, we can say that you go on your work, but definitely you have to think in your mind. If there is criticism, you have to think twice, thrice, whether there is any fault of yours. If there is any fault of yours, you rectify that. You rectify that and go on working. Don't give your air to that work, which is very much harmful for you because in your mind what you are doing there is no dishonesty and your well wiser those are telling your work is very much support, supported by them then smoothly you go on working without any any hesitation any problem that's all.